Okay, I'm going to do a little uh, Kubota seat review here, or unboxing, whatever the heck you want to call it, of this cheap flashlight I just got off eBay for like 20 bucks, shipped, which is super awesome for me. First, let's look at the flashlight itself. I got the head cam here. I know it's a little waggly. Claims to have 1300 lumens, you know that's total BS of course, but first thing I like to do when I get a flashlight is I try to take it all apart. Okay, I'm feeling here, it's not a whole lot of friction on that O-ring, kind of loose on the O-ring. Let's take this apart, take a good look at the reflector, see the quality of it. Enough threads on the damn thing. My God. Okay, here's a little piece of glass. You can see they did a really super thin coating of whatever this is, paint or anodization. Here's the reflector. You can see the defect in it clearly, right? You can see that defect. There's the Cree, or so-called Cree LED, whatever it is, probably a Chinese copy of whatever people want, which is how that works, right? So that's one part, all right. And it just doesn't feel quality. The, the aluminum feels very light. So I've I've had a number of different kinds of flashlights. This one, the aluminum doesn't feel to be that super heavy duty aluminum. Now there should be the this part here separates the head from the body. Now that the O-ring feels a little tighter. About standard. Kind of see the quality of the of the melon and stuff. It's it's super fast. They're blasting these things out of uh, as fast as possible. Yeah, you know, you know what are you gonna get for twenty bucks, right? It comes with batteries and chargers. So let me show you those in just a second. But I wanted to get the tail cap off, and we can look at that and see what kind of deal we got here. I'm I've got a a, re a remote switch and tail cap coming. Sounds good, feels good, nice and tactile. Nice clicky switch, clicky clicky. Crazy green color. I kind of like it. Okay, let's look at the rest of the goods that are in here in this bag that says made in China, shipped from China. Oh, okay, let's drop it. It's a charger. Okay, let's see what that looks like. I'm probably going to have to charge the batteries. That's my kids for you. Don't you love kids? They're so freaking loud. How loud can you be? Let's find out. I'll be a kid and I'll be super freaking loud. So that's, you know, standard. We'll see if it works. I don't know until I plug it in. Right? And then it comes with a couple of batteries. Let's see what kind of batteries they sent. Okay. So the light and the batteries are all branded Ultra Fire, whatever that means. They claim to be 3,000 milliamp hours, which is good because a lot of them that you see out there come with 2400 milliamp hour batteries. Let's see if I can just get that out of there. Boy, that thing is really sealed. I guess they don't want those puppies coming out anytime soon. <clears throat> Must resist urge to use teeth to open package. Cannot resist urge much longer. Okay, good. Well, the deal is to see, wow, this thing is so light, my god, this is battery weighs nothing. It feels like it's totally empty. Is there anything in it? That's crazy. Well, I doubt that there's a charge in it, but let's find out. Okay. Any light? Let's see. No, it's dead. It's totally flat. So, that makes sense. Unless it's a pre-charge. So we'll go plug this in in the house and check it out and I'll let you know.